There is a line here that divides the cabana users from the non-cabana users and you must not pass it. I do feel like making a run for it though. Freedom! Hello and good morning friends. We are just getting off of the boat in all of its grand glory. I am going to run the Castaway Key 5K this morning. It's gonna be a ton of fun. I'm getting off without Brandon and the kids. We're gonna run this. It's only three miles, it's a 5K, and it's gonna be super awesome. So I'm gonna take you guys along with me. Everyone's here, we've got our bibs, we're all ready to start. I did bring my headphones to keep me a little bit focused while I run because if I talk, I get out of breath and then I get sightings. Very hot. Listening to my music helps me stay going. So excited. Thank you. Thank you. What it's for. Just finished up. Got my Disney medal. That's the whole reason I did this. It's for the medal. All finished up, but left my group of friends. It was super fun to run it with people. I met all of those girls here on the cruise boat, so that was really fun, except for one girl. I knew her before, and that was really fun. So I'm gonna go back, get the family. They're probably getting breakfast and getting ready right now, and then we'll head out to the beach. Should be super fun. Hello, good morning from another Caribbean island. This one is Disney. It's Mickey's private island called Castaway Key. Mom has been up this morning before us. She wanted to go a fun little Castaway 5K. Getting her wiggles out, getting her run in. Mom is incredible. Incredible, up early, out there running, documenting it for you guys, and we are so stoked to be back together as a family now. She has just finished up her run, and we're gonna go down and join her on this gorgeous private Disney island. Today, what do we have in store, you guys? Snorkeling. 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 We bring our snorkels. We can even use the ones we got yesterday when we swam with dolphins. If you haven't seen that video yet, guys, go check that out. We swam with dolphins. We got a snorkel set. We're gonna go take the snorkels out here and go out into this beautiful, beautiful blue water. Supposedly, there's some buried sunken treasure. We're gonna go hunting for some treasure, and then on top of that, oh, Brexy, you've already got a sailboat right on your face there, but you're ready to rock, dude. You're ready to sail. And then there's also like characters from the Disney universe that have been sunk and buried out there. So we're gonna go and see if we can find them, snorkel by them. And this is our last full day on the cruise. This is our last day on the cruise. We get off tomorrow. So we're gonna go tear it up as long as we can out there in the sun before we head back to Utah's snow. You guys ready to go have some fun? Oh yeah. Let's go. Mom just got back from her 5K this morning. Look at you. She got a castaway key 5K. So it's just the castaway. Oh, the castaway key 5K. 5K. Man, this is really hard to say because that looks like a K. I just rammed again. Anyways, I'm gonna say the castaway <laughs> K 5K because it sounds a lot cooler. She just I came know. back with that cool giant metal and then this awesome huge thick lanyard. I know, isn't this cool? And look at you, you've got a race number and everything. How was it? It was awesome. It was really awesome. It's really warm out there. So you guys, today's gonna be awesome. Oh, but there was a little bit breeze and like just the palm trees around you. There was actually a portion two or three times where we ran on like the runway for the airport. What? So that was cool. So I got to run on the airway. Jetway? Jetway. Runway? Got to run on the jetway <laughs> runway. I just ran. Ran it with four other girls and it was really fun. We had a great time. That is amazing. I just love this thing. This one's hanging up with some pride in the house and it's also pretty unique, pretty rare. It's Not everybody Disney, can get one of those. people. <laughs> We just arrived at Pelican Point. This is where we're gonna be doing our snorkeling, hanging out all day. The water is beautiful, but look, we've got a fun little water park right there with like a slide and a bucket that dumps water. And they've got a Maddie. Oh my gosh, this place has a Maddie. Oh. This place literally has everything. So we're trying to grab some chairs right now. We're trying to grab a little spot of sand, a little slice of paradise right here. But look at this beautiful blue water. We've got this fun little area to play in. You've got just shoreline for days of this beautiful white sand. And then we're gonna go out and we're gonna snorkel and we're gonna try and find some sunken treasure. The kids have got their snorkel gear. We've got all of our stuff. We've got sunscreen because it is hot. It's sunny and we're ready for it. If you remember, we went to the Disney store ahead of time and we loaded up with some Disney swag. Check out these Ooh. swimming suits. Perfect to break out on Mickey's own private island. And Mickey is pointing to the fun, bro. He's ready for you to go out there and have some fun. Are you ready to have some fun? Oh, yeah. <laughs> we went out there to get in the water and they told us that you absolutely have to have these inflatable vests. I was going to go like free solo diving, like no big deal. I did not want a flotation device of any kind. I was not worried at all about getting tired. Insert sarcasm. And <laughs> they told us you literally have to get these. So I was like, oh, if you, they won't think that I got one because I was nervous to swim. Everyone has to have one. So everyone out here who's snorkeling right now has got this. On. So we're gonna go out into this area right here We're told this is where you can find some of the sunken treasure the characters things like that And we just found out we were just told that actually the ones like the best stuff the stuff that you want to see is clear out by those lifeguard towers You probably can't even see those in here. So we're going off for a little swim
We're feeling pretty safe. Let's do this. <laughs> okay, now we've been told they're by the buoy, so we're gonna go to the buoy. I can't see anything. My goggles keep fogging up. Not gonna lie, this is pretty awesome. As you go and venture out this way, it becomes incredibly shallow. You can just walk right through it. We're gonna walk out. So I think the buoys we're looking for are even further out there than we thought. A couple more lifeguard towers out there. You can find any of this buried treasure. All right, that was last night. We found it. We found treasure. We found Walter. We found a sunken ship. <laughs> Gross. Raga, you want to go down for a little sport? Their kids are over on the other side of this little bay. They are snorkeling, looking for Mickey, and I have Hazy and Brex. We're just hanging out by the water. We bought lots of buckets and sand toys. Brex, what you got? I'm um, castle filled with water. Oh my gosh, that's so awesome. Guys, go to the water slides and stuff. Okay, let's go. <laughs> We just got back fresh off of our snorkeling excursion. We found sunken treasure. Yeah. We found a submarine. Yeah. And we found Mickey. Mickey. <laughs> Mickey Mouse. Guys, out I touched there. Mickey. I touched Mickey. <laughs> Literally hand. touched his hand. <laughs> that was fun. It was a much bigger swim than anticipated. I got very tired. I forgot about like the whole mustache and snorkeling thing. I should have learned my lesson on that one from our cruise that we took last year because the water just comes right in if you don't have that jelly stuff. So, anyways, I ended up just treating it like a swimming pool. I just held my breath yeah. and swam as much as I could, and then I'd come back up. So incredible. So fun to go out and find those things. We're back now with the family. I think we're gonna go tear up this little mini water park and then grab some lunch. Lunch! All right, you guys, now we're gonna go on to this floating little island of fun. Hazy, are you ready for this? Yeah. <laughs> you wanna go down the slide? Who are you gonna go with? Yeah. Yeah, baby. Yes, go with me. We'll go both sides. We'll do one and then we'll come back and we'll do the other. And they got this bucket dump. Guys, this is a tropical paradise. You got the cruise ship right over there. You got this right here. Next up, we're gonna do the sandbar, but first we're gonna have to eat. Guys, I'm getting way ahead of myself. It's slip and slide time. You ready for a little water slide action? Yeah. <laughs> Okay, Hazy, I'm gonna go down first and then I'll catch you at the bottom, okay? Okay. I'll see you, Hazy, okay? <laughs> what did you think? Did you love it? Yeah. <laughs> bong, bong, bong. Bong, did you bounce around? Yeah. <laughs> On Disney's private island, they bring in all their chefs, and you will not believe the variety of food here. Oh I just gosh. looked over, we have burgers Everything. cooking, we have smoked ribs, we have chicken sandwiches, we have hot dogs for the kids, we've got boiled chicken, we've got corn on the cob, everything you can imagine. Then just behind me, we've got all the sodas, drinks, and then the greatest part of all, you guys, here on an island, they have soft serve ice cream. So the kids are still getting their soft serve cones on the ship, off the ship, doesn't matter. Nobody does it like Disney, you guys. This lunch is incredible. Hey, what are you gonna get for lunch? Um, ribs and hot dogs. Chips and cookies. First thing on Maddie's plate, couscous and some slaw. It's, a, it's the first it. thing in the line. <laughs> Riley, on the other hand, has soft serve ice cream. <laughs> you get everything you wanted? Ribs, hot dog, cookie, chips, and fruit, just like you wanted. Yeah. He doesn't know where to start. <laughs> Is that a good <laughs> little tongue comes out? Is that a good one? Yeah. Yeah. 
just finished up that delicious dinner. That was awesome. And we had a ton of ice cream. Did you enjoy? I really, 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 really enjoyed it. Thank you. And she just also <laughs> did correct me that it was lunch. I don't know why I called it dinner. I don't know. It's a food, it's a meal. We ate. We just finished up a delicious lunch. <laughs> Putting that whole thing in. Anyways, now is the time. One of the activities that we want to do is wander out to the sandbar over there. You can just walk right out there. For some reason, that just feels cool. I'm gonna take the 360 camera with me. We're gonna walk out there on that sandbar. We're gonna bask in this glorious sun. We're gonna soak up some heat. We're gonna get some warmth, some vitalizing sun, vitamin D. And it's gonna be epic. Okay, you guys, so sandbar is for cabana guests only, so don't even try it, because we got the smack down pretty fast. There is a line here that divides the cabana users from the non-cabana users, and you must not pass it. So, instead, you have to settle for looking at it right there. I do feel like making a run for it, though, because I don't think she's catching me if I go to the end. I'm doing this for you, folks. On your mark. Freedom! I'm pretty sure you nailed it. Hey, so I just stole Brandon's camera, just walking around the beach, no big deal, check me out. Yep, look how ridiculous I look with this big giant stick. We have had an incredible day on the island of Castaway Key. Memories were made, we played in the sun. Kids just loved every second of it. We had to like pull them off of the beach. We're heading back to the boat today and saying farewell to Disney's private island, Castaway Key. We're gonna also go in and get cleaned up, get our bags packed and get ready for dinner. Did I get any sun today? Maybe a little, a little. bit. Yeah, a little bit of sun. So you guys, Sunscreen. we're back on the ship now. We're about to go have dinner. I love how they switch up the dining halls. We're on our third dining hall know, kind of, of the cruise. Completely new vibe. It's called it's the Royal all of them. Palace. Let's go see what it's all about. Hazel tonight is dressed up as Queen Elsa. She's got her Elsa braid. Can I show them your shoes really quick, Hazy? Look at these amazing princess shoes. Oh my goodness, they sparkle. They look like they have rainbow glitter all over them. Hazel, you look amazing. Look at that. What, the napkins are folded in like royal shirts? And now it's just a napkin. Welcome to the Royal Palace Dining Hall. Our final meal on the cruise ship. I am very excited. Exotic things on the menu tonight, Mom. What are you gonna go with? I just not anything she's gonna like. Oh, they have a steak. Okay, guys, the choices are lamb, duck, lobster. I'm like, salmon. I'm like, what is Mindy going to order off of this? So they have a steak. That's what mom's gonna get is the steak. We've got a tired princess at dinner here. Queen Elsa is taking a little nap on my lap during the main course. We just finished up dinner, delicious. The best part of all though, Elsa slept on my lap the entire time. Or Hazy, I mean, sorry, Hazy. It's absolutely adorable. So now, we just dropped off the other boys at the kids club. Hazy was saying she's still a little bit too tired to go there. We've got some packing to do. Some serious packing to do. Mom's gonna jump on the packing. I'm gonna start pre-editing as much as I can, so I don't have to be up till three o'clock in the morning tonight, hopefully. And when Hazy's feeling a little more up to it, we'll take her to the kids club. We're gonna go catch the last show. The shows have been amazing. Of the cruise. The shows have been unreal. Like, absolutely unreal. Now, we pack. We gotta get everything out the doors in the hallway. Now, something that's cool that the Disney Cruise Line offers, we actually have our bags taken care and checked all the way through to the airport in Salt Lake City. So once we put them out in the hallway, we won't see them or touch them again until they're at our home on the baggage belt. Hopefully that works. We don't yeah. know. Never heard of that before. Get everything packed up, you guys. But we have had the most spectacular, uh, it's been absolutely unbelievable incredible. time. The entire experience, start to finish, Disney World, Disney Cruise. We've just been taken care of. We've been just Disney's pampered. Been incredible to us. Disney, thank you so much. There is a huge amount of work that goes into putting an event like this oh together. Gosh. I don't even know how they do it, but it goes like clockwork. It is smooth. It is seamless. It's just 
just enjoyable. Yeah. Never once does it feel like work or effort. It's just fun. So Disney, thank you so yes, much for this opportunity. You. We have absolutely loved it. Kids we know have loved it. Made a ton <laughs> of friends. We've made some friends. It's just been unforgettable. Truly unforgettable. It has been magical. Yes, like I know that's really Disney's word, it, but it's magical. That is a real thing though here. Yes. It is real. We've been feeling the magic. So you guys, we're going to wrap up this vlog so we can get packed up and we can get these bags out in the hallway and we will see you guys tomorrow as we head back home, back to real life. <laughs> <laughs> Boo. Maddie goes back as well. Join us for that. It's traveling, the flight home. Find out what we do Always in between an when adventure. we get off the ship and when we get on the plane because we got to kill some time there. Lots. Go back to Disney World. We love you guys. See you tomorrow. Bye.